Hey guys, it's Ray over at Sahara Coins. Um, we've talked a lot about counterfeits in the past. We've talked a lot about uh, weighing your coins, measuring your coins, all the different things you can do uh, to you know, combat owning a counterfeit. Um, recently, in the last probably month, month and a half, we have seen an influx in counterfeit trade dollars, counterfeit Morgan dollars, and counterfeit peace dollars. Uh, most of these are the Chinese counterfeits. They're not made of any silver. They're not made of any precious metal. Uh, they're what we call pot metal. So it could be a mixture of tin. Uh, we've seen them made of, of iron. I've also seen things made of, of uh, lead. And believe it or not, you can grab them and bend them. But what usually happens is it'll be someone will approach you or it might be online like a Craigslist scenario where they tell you, hey, I've got this whole sheet. I'm trying to get rid of them. My grandpa gave them to me, which that's the line we're hearing a lot now. And it's, uh, I tell you what, I just really need the quick bucks, uh, 80 bucks for this sheet, and there's, there's 10 coins here. Um, that should be a red flag for you. Uh, 10 coins that are supposedly silver dollars, someone offering to you for 80 bucks, it's $8 a coin. The silver value alone is worth 14 to $15. So I would definitely avoid jumping into a deal that sounds too good to be true. I'm sure you've heard that with many other things. Um, what you wanna do is make sure you take those coins if you are meeting with somebody to purchase them, take your scale. Take it, weigh the coins, pull up your red book. Look in your red book, you can get all the specs on the coins, you can weigh them, you can measure them, do all of the things that we have tried to teach you to diagnose whether it is a counterfeit or not. Now, if, if you didn't watch those videos, make sure you go back on our channel. There's videos about how to detect counterfeits. Look at what we do, look at the information we gave you. Use that information to help protect yourself. And again, educate yourself on coin weights, on coin purities. There's a lot of dead giveaways when you're looking at these counterfeits that once you educate yourself on these specific coins, you'll be able to spot them no problem. So again, education is key here. Protect yourself, protect your portfolio, do your homework, and let's make sure you have a great collection.